priority, that's right. Prices like these here at this Exxon gas station is making it hard for professionals who drive for work to get money in their pockets. But as they live with these prices, they're trying to cut down on costs, but keep operations going. Small businesses that rely on gas to fuel their services say they are feeling the pain at the pump. We're getting hammered on fuel surcharges. We're paying anywhere between 75 and 150 dollars more per week. Dominion floor covering has been serving the community for more Excess than three decades, yeah. but Velarde yeah. says he has now had to cut back on his services. We try to keep most of our business on the peninsula and the south side, whereas before we went anywhere from the Outer Banks to Richmond. With close to 10 delivery drivers, Velarde says his drivers sometimes have to use their own vehicles to make deliveries, leading him to make some necessary changes for his drivers along the way. We supplement their uh, income with an increase uh, like a subsidy uh, to offset the cost of gas. According to AAA, the average gas price in Hampton Rose is $3.58. However, some stations are selling them as high as $3.99. And experts say prices could tick even higher if tensions continue between Ukraine and Russia, a major export of fuel. And rising gas prices mean rising delivery costs for business owners like Velarde. It's insane. Uh, it's gone up about 10%. Meanwhile, Gary Logan, a Uber Eats and DoorDash driver, spends up to eight hours a day delivering food. But the majority of his funds recently are going straight in the tank and then tips they're not increasing right they're going at the same rate uh, as before gas went up so um you know it's just difficult there causing him to calculate how far away he is how long it's going to take to get there and is it worth him going 15 minutes away to make deliveries i'm gonna look in the um uber eats or doordash paying us for mileage i mean we're providing the service to them right um, getting the food to the people if you're looking for ways to save we have a story up on our website on how you can save at the pump and newport news kelsey jones news three all right, here's some tips to keep you from refilling your tank too often. Keep your tires properly inflated and reduce your speed. Slowing down 5 to 10 miles an hour on the highway can increase your fuel economy as much as 14%. Plus, make sure you're not hauling around any extra weight in your vehicle that you're not using. And lastly, shop around. AAA suggests that you compare gas prices around the region before you let your tank go to E. And we've actually already done that for you. Right now, the highest gas prices in our area can be found at Virginia Beach. Prices at the pump there are averaging about 373 per gallon. That's higher than the state of Virginia average at 371. For the cheapest prices, check out Suffolk. AAA is reporting their gas prices at about 367.